Oh, Professor. What are you doing? Hello, Hayata. I've been checking the present attacks and I discovered something interesting. Oh, really? Yes. I'm certain you know about the monsters Zilla and Gueras and Natsuno Meru. Well, I've been thinking. Why didn't Godzilla kill them? And then I noticed, when Godzilla defeats them, this emerges out of them. What the? What's that? I couldn't identify it. It's some sort of red gaseous. So I made a theory. Perhaps Godzilla is not just fighting them, but rather is also trying to save them. So, you mean... I believe the red gas is controlling some of the monsters we face. My God! Mount Tahoe is a dumb thing! Mount Tahoe? How could this be? Get the captain immediately! Kai, this is the captain. Any others behind the mountain? Negative, sir. No one is around. Soldiers! Try to get everyone out of here. Now! Yes, sir. Alright, people. Let's go. Let's go! Quickly! Hey, sir! We gotta get you out of here. It's not safe here. He's... angry. What? The one of fire. He's upset of something. One of fire? Let's go, come on! No! I wish to witness him! What was that?
Oh no! Guy! You pterodactyl looking bastard! Are you alright? Oh, not really. My arm. Don't worry. We'll get you checked out. Guys! Ayara, are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. El de huevo. De huevo. Yo, what, what, what's he say? I don't know. He's been saying it the way down. Sir, relax. You're safe now. We won't be safe for long. What do you mean? The sky shines of red. A sign of anger. He will go on a rampage. And will not stop until he's calm. If he ever does. Martin. Do you have any idea where the monster is heading? Unfortunately not. We can't get a scan on it. It's too fast. Like, really fast. Alright. We gotta go now. Sir, come with us. No! I wish to stay. It is my home. Are you sure? I'll be fine. Alright. Let's go. Hayata! Do not kill him. I know your true power. I sense it. Please. We got Hayata! We gotta go! Farewell, Ultraman. Checkups? We got a file? Yes. The irradiated pterosaur Rodan, codenamed Red Devil, first spotted in 1956 and was destroyed. Last record was in 2004 where it destroyed New York and escaped. Could it be the one from 2004? It's a possibility, yes, but it may also be a third generation of Rodan. Martin, I was told you have a plan. Indeed I do. Now, it's dangerous, but it may work. So, Rodan possesses armor plating on its chest and legs, so shooting there won't do any good. So this is where my new invention comes in. Comes in. The Obliteration M Cannon. It's able to fire a highly concentrated electrical heat energy. We take out the wings and finish him off. Huh. Alright. But how exactly do we bring him here? That's where the dangerous part of the plan comes in. We, uh, we need someone to get in the jet, file a couple rounds on him to get his attention. I can't do it. I need both arms. And obviously one of them is broken. I'll do it. I can try to get the devil over here. Great. Soldiers? Operation Red Devil is a go. Chuck, we got a scan of it. It's right there. You know what to do. All right, locked on target.
boy, he's on my tail. Man, he's fast. All right, Martin, ready the cannons. On it, locked in fire. Did it work? Hayata, do not kill him, please, Ultraman.
Martin, quick! Fire the cannon! All right. Fire! Yada! Chuck, you alright? Yeah, yeah, you? Yeah, cool. Let's go back to the base now. Right behind you. Welcome back to another episode of Daikaiju Files, where we take a look at the monsters of today's episode. Today's episode was insane, Professor. Really, it was. Indeed, it was, Martin. Now then, we're going to be taking a look at the monster of today's episode. So here he is, Rodan, codename Red Devil, the Flying Monster. His height is at 100 meters, wingspan at 200 meters, and weight at 30,000 tons. When it comes to abilities, he has tremendous strength. He can fly at sonic speeds and leave debris and rubble across, and can use his talents to grab his opponents. Well, that's all for now, kiddos. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you guys learned something. 
See you later, guys.